I see. So you just gonna bend over and do whatever he say? No. But this time, he's right. Look, I gave you all a chance. Did this shit for as long as I could, but this little experiment is not working. I'm happy to split the profits with y'all 50-50. But you gotta come home. Get this operation under one roof. No, we ain't doing that. Why? Why not? Because I don't want to put my life, our life, at risk for your bullshit-ass decisions. Is that it? Or is it that you're so sure that you're so much smarter than everybody else? You're tired of this. Lions fighting over sheep. This between me and him. Oh, yeah? So won't you handle it then? Boom! That's right. Because I know breaking away wasn't Jerome's idea. And I let it go. Because you've been shot. Been through some traumatic shit. Hey, you let it go? Yeah, that's right, for her. Don't talk out your goddamn neck, boy. <laughs> well, then maybe you can enlighten me, Unc, on what the fuck she wants. Nah. Won't you ask her yourself, then? What would you like, Queen Louis? What's gonna make you happy? Because nothing seems to do it for you. How about not being under anybody's thumb, nephew? Well, I hate to break it to you, but everybody's got to answer to somebody. And me, I answer to the man who may have disappeared, my fucking father, and who would do the same to us if we don't move this product. Now, I don't know about y'all two, but I'd like to stay alive long enough to enjoy what I've made. So from here on out, I don't want to hear anything else about kilos or prices. Y'all want to go out on your own? Fine, but do not for one second fuck around with what I got to do to get mine, because I promise you there is nothing I'm not prepared to do.